<clears throat> All right, welcome back, everyone, to Ashes of the Old World, episode six, episode uh, part two. Uh, lest we were, uh, lest we, l l lest we were at, I was trying to railroad Tarnock into something. <laughs> Tarnock. <laughs> mm. Yes. I got half a map to don't you? I want to see. I run over to set this character, grab him out of the collar, and drag him back over. Are you allowing this, uh, Citrin? Okay. I build strength check. I go <clears> over <throat> to set this character, grab him by the fluffy collar that I know he has, <laughs> and drag him back over. Ah! And I, I just keep pointing at this one thing, like. Okay, what is he? Po what are you pointing at? The number, number four, four thing on Craig's listing. <laughs> Okay. What of it? I pull out the map from my bag that is obviously been eaten before and show him. Wait, you ate this? And you get it back. Tarnak just gives him a squint and shrugs. Hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and look over to Akra and Zealous and wait. Oh, speaking of which, Akra, uh, roll the po uh, poker chip uh, roll four times? Actually, hold on. Five, six. Six more times? Oh my god! Oh my goodness. You know, I thought this was going to be good times, but... <laughs> I think I'm what are we doing? Poker chip time. <laughs> hey, look, at least it doesn't... At least it's not procking for us all the time. No, you see, because you're always in our immediate vicinity. does not find bugbears attractive. You see, the thing is, if you exited and then re-entered her vicinity, then it would proc on you. Oh, God. Uh... See, there's no other benefit to this poker chip. It's just get charmed. I mean, they were explicitly cursed items. <laughs> yes, they were. All right. Uh, to be fair, if she's crafty, she can uh, palm that on somebody. Yeah, so you're noticing that your poker chip, uh, chip of uh, love is dinging a whole bunch of times, but you're like, shit up. <laughs> All right, so Akra and Zealous, uh, Derek is looking at you. What... Is responsos. Me. Don't even. Like. <coughs> like what? <sighs> Dan? Dan. We've lost him. Um, oh, no. there he is. Hey, Dan. What's up? Oh, I don't know. Okay, so, Derek, what we... Go ahead, sir. I'm waving them over for Tarnock's map half. <clears throat> My only approach out of curiosity. <laughs> okay. Uh, Zealous, did you hear that with your, uh... I guess, I mean... Okay. Alright, so you all walk over. You notice that uh, under Greg's listing mentions someone having half a map to a dungeon and Tarnock having half a map to a dungeon. Yep. I will be totally up for that. Hit me <clears> one is. <throat> what are the odds of this being for, the, for a different place? Hmm. Hmm. You'd have to go and find out, wouldn't you? Yeah, no, it doesn't seem very likely that it would. Mm -hmm. huh. While everyone's looking at this, I'm gonna kind of just aside back to the first wanted list. Do I recognize that name? Uh, roll history. With advantage, because it's family member. Okay, so that is... Uh, your cousin. 
you know that you have an uncle in Anxi, and he had a uh, a daughter named Ran Rani, and that's your cousin. So this is so this is what you've been up to. Mm hmm. They're uh, pretty distant cousins, given the fact that uh, the distance between Anxi and Seabreeze is about a whole between islands, but that's about <laughs> as distant, it's, distant <clears throat> as it's going to get. Still, I have my signet ring and shit, so... Yeah. <clears throat> I, c I can show up on good old uncle's doorstep and just say, yo. <laughs> Sup, fucker? I noticed your daughter's uh, being a doing a crime. All right, so where's the consensus for this? Are you going to attempt to deal with one of the wanted lists or have yourself a dungeon crawl? I would personally recommend that we talk to the armed escort guy first so we know when they want to leave. Yeah. Because if we can make the trip and get paid for it... <laughs> yeah. Get All right. Yeah, you are roboting like crazy. Oh, really? Oh, damn. Uh, hold on. Hmm. <laughs> I'm hoping it's not something... Domi origato. How is this going to affect the recording? Oh, badly. You probably shouldn't talk it while you're It anymore. won't affect his end of the recording? Yeah, it's not going to affect me. Yeah, no. How is his robot? What do we robot when he does? No. Okay. Oh, good. Okay. All right. So, uh, Gregel, uh, if if you're going to be uh, looking for Lord Skyglint, uh, Gregel actually gives you directions to exactly where that dude is. Cause, okay. You know, they kind of have to set something up. You know, like to find the person, or else like. What the hell is the point of putting a listing down? <clears throat> All right, I'm gonna go take a look at that one. Um, Derek's gonna look over to the group and just say, "Somebody look into that dungeon angle." I I'm gonna go see about the escort. Okay, let's. Uh... Very well. Um, I guess I'm gonna go with turn off then. Okay. Once turn off, you know, starts stops coughing up his existence. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna pull you hackers. Uh... All over the map. Did any of the shop owners like see me coughing at all and be like, "Do you want to buy this antidote?" Uh, they just hand it to you. Honestly, it's it's such a common occurrence. They got a whole cauldron's worth of antidote. So it just scoops up a cup of it and hands it to you. Uh, so that's there. And failing. Convenient. <laughs> Going to. <clears throat> There. I'll, I'll die from the terrible water and the Niv bugbear. This isn't, doesn't seem like a bad place to live. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why it would be. Meanwhile, Niv. Hmm. Just... Sorry, what, Dan? Niv is, Niv is just. The Niv's. The, the Niv. You get rid of the Niv thing in this place. Is perfect. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. All right, so thematically, let's start with the dungeon thing, and then we'll head over to uh, the um, Lord Sky Glint. So you walk up to uh, apparently this kobold who, who who's waving at the kobold on your shoulder, Tarnock. Oh no. Hmm. Uh, you're not lagging anymore, I don't think. Yeah, you're not lagging anymore, you're fine now. Oh. Uh, okay, so you So you heard all that, yes? Yes. Relatively yes and no. Yaggy, but it wasn't terrible. Where'd my character go? You're over here. 
Yeah, drag you over. Let me see. I see, I see, I see. Okay, so you walk up to this cold. Oh, hole. is this where the map guy is? She's a girl. Map girl, Thank yes. You. So you walk up to this uh, this map girl, this kobold, this little one who is waving at the kobold on your shoulder, who is also waving at the kobold in front of you. And she says, Hey there! Ugh. Okay, hello! My name's <laughs> Hem! I, uh, show a little? I take out the map and just put show it to her face. Oh my god, you got uh, got half the map. I got half the map too. Okay, kid, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna join Jark to punch her face in. What? Just no. Shut her what? up. I'm not punching her. Yeah, totally. You're totally. You you, you totally said that. Yes. No, I'm kidding. No, I didn't. Oh. I'm kidding. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Are you saying that Tarnock should hit on her? <laughs> Not in the cold balls. Especially since I have one on my shoulder all the time. Okay. Um. So she uh, she rummages around in a uh, little oh, little. Pa- Hold on, Gate. Yeah. Stop. Um. You're roboting. Oh joy. Makes me want to rip them tear until it's done. Oh, well, I gotta exit these <laughs> random Google things over here. It does make me angry? It does. Um, I can only assume someone's watching Netflix or something. Uh, Get your lagging. Yes, um... He knows it's just that everything he's saying still has to process through Discord. <laughs> and in oh. fact, the, the recording isn't even slightly affected by it. It's just... Your, uh, your audibility, to be, uh, audibility to, toward it. And when your audio comes back toward me, it's perfectly clean and clear. It's just... <laughs> okay, anyway, go ahead. Yes, let's go ahead. Um, back to here. Uh, God damn it. So this kobold takes out her half of her 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 map half and says things probably. Um, it doesn't help that I also have certain pauses of my own, and you can notice uh, when when she holds it up, it seems a little familiar, but not quite the same. Hmm. Uh, perception or like, ooh, do I have to like roll dungeoneering? Maybe. Uh, here's here's what you do. You put the two map paths together and use common sense. Yeah. See, that's <laughs> why I'm the meathead of the group. That's why I'm the meathead. So okay. I basically take her piece and put it next to mine. I don't care if she put any resistance up. Why would she? She's she just seems incredibly excited about the fact you have half a map. So I put them together. Do they look similar? Oh my god, Do they I connect? My god. Yuck! What are the chances? <laughs> Some random, uh, random lizard comes up and show, shows me a uh, half a map that's exactly the same. Urge to eat rising. <laughs> this dungeon crawl's gonna be a breeze! All right, so yeah, that's that. She she's got the, the her half of the map matches exactly your half. Not like it's the same half of the map because that'd be fucking hilarious. But she has uh, the other half of the map, and she's excitedly about like hopping up and down about it. Aww. Wait, um, so. Is she hoppy up and down? Inside of that, she has found the other half of the map, which we got. Yes. Oh my god. There's an echo in here. Okay, okay, just... okay. Uh, Can I just somehow convince her to give us a map using my entertainer charm? It... Um, Matt, uh, let me... why, not, why not have a follower? 
No. Shut up. Let me listen to how. Uh, I can't hear. Yes. Yeah, so let, 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 let me um, dis dispense to you some knowledge. <laughs> she put a, a listing out in Greg's listing about a dungeon she wanted to explore, and she has half a map for. Tarnock uh -huh. has the other half of the map. She is by okay. all means willing to willing to give you the map, just as uh -huh. long as she gets to go into the dungeon as well. Oh, okay then. All right. Also, my map. I get to decide what happens. I'm not talking about your map. I'm talking about her map. Fuck off. But since I have the map, I have like priority on uh, leadership, even though I shouldn't have it. Oh Jesus <laughs> Christ! So, anyway, we'll do some backflips. Um, Alright, so what are you doing, Thomas? Anyway. Okay, yeah, uh, anyway, yeah, uh, she could come and join us, I guess. There's, no one has anything against this, do they? Uh, I mean, oh, see, that's, no, okay. Yeah, yeah, Dan, I guess they are. <laughs> okay. Except for the one on my shoulder. <laughs> So she comes along. Yes. All right. So actually, let's move back to Acra before we forget. What What are you doing, Acra? Are you just still in there, or did you go with Derek to the other dude? Wait, are you asking me? I'm asking Dan. No. I'm gonna say retroactively. Oh, okay. with, uh, I guess Tarnock, because I'd rather not be. Uh... Rather not follow Derek around. Okay. <laughs> Anything but following Derek, because the urge to prank is too great. <laughs> All right. So over here then with uh, Derek, to resolve the yep. other side of this uh, thing. Uh, let me just expand this dude's pod for a second. Show them. <laughs> okay, pretty standard. Yes, pretty standard poorly drawn pod. Yes. And who the hell are you supposed to be? I may have got your listing. Oh, good. Only question, I, only question I have is when do you plan on leaving? Uh, as soon as I can. Maybe two or three days from now. I still have to gather up some supplies. All right. Do you mind if we take? You don't mind if we you don't mind if we take our effects with you. We're headed that way anyway. Hmm. Well, I suppose hardly a smart idea to deprive guards of equipment. I'm sorry. I'm getting distracted by the bunny Loch Ness monster coming out of the bridge next to you. <laughs> I don't even know who's drawing that, but that's hilarious. Thank you. <laughs> That's now canonically there. Um, <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> not my fault. You know, you're not gonna be laughing when he uses that against us later. I'm gonna stat it, and it's gonna be CR10. It's gonna kill all of you. Anyway, um, <laughs> you don't have any uh, goblins with you, do you? No. Okay, good. Well. uh... Well, ask him if he has anything against lizards. I'll see you at the uh, gate in three days, I suppose. Bring your... Well, just bring weaponry, I guess. I've been waiting so fucking long for just an armed escort. It's getting a little irritating. You're right back again. I'm going to give you a fair warning on this so you're not confused. Mm -hmm. My entourage is... strange. Exactly. They are capable fighters, however... Don't worry about them. Half of them don't even use weapons. Uh, don't let that take you off guard. That's, um... That's too late. It's already taken me off guard, but... I'll see what you mean in a bit, I suppose. Whether you... Whether you prefer to or not, unfortunately. I'm going to just assume strange means non-human and leave it at that. That's where it starts. Wonderful. Well, uh, by the way, we have a vested interest in getting to Axie ourselves. Oh, well, gods of convenience, I guess. 
problem. Three days? Three days, yes. I'll, uh, note it down. I'd rather not get jumped by bandits whilst I'm over to Anxi, and I do have some shiny, uh, shiny armor that they just like jumping on. Not that they'd survive, just I'd rather not be attacked every five feet. Oh, don't worry. Their first encounter with us, they won't do it again. Ah, that's good to hear. Well, uh, guess I'll see you in five days. Uh, bleh, three days, then. Understood. Understood. Thank you. Alright, so that's, that's that solved. Alright, I'm back. Oh, fucking okay. amazing timing, Matt. Holy yeah. shit. However yeah, long, do yeah. You, okay. I I just went to go oh. bathroom. That's it. Um, Gate. However long you decide it's going to take, Derek is going to wander around and look for everybody else. Uh, let's time skip that shit. Honestly. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so. And we've picked up a cobalt. <laughs> you have. Okay, can can um can just during the time skip? Can I use my Tinger charm to? Get this counts on view armor. I am so I could give it to her. You know, the, uh, um, the, the time red skip listener. As, time skip as in like the five minutes it takes the rest of us to recon. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so. I have some spare armor, but if you want to do that, I will not stop you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> right. Um... You're going to do all that in five minutes. <laughs> okay. That's going to be fucking amazing. That's like a montage. Uh. I'm okay with montage. Yeah, yeah. I, I thought we were gonna do montage. montage. I, just, I just thought that. I mean, there's right. nothing wrong with that, is there? No. Gate, okay, Gate, what are we doing? Alright, so, no, I gotta, you know, figure out what the hell Met said. Met, what did you say before <laughs> re things? Um, I'm, I said during the time skip, mm -hmm. we're gonna do a little montage so we can get some armor for the Red Lizard listen thing. I don't know. Oh, you're gonna buy your armor? Was... Okay. That's adorable. Doesn't Phelan have spare armor? I know. D don't, don't, just, just I let have spare, spare armor! armor. I just just let, let him have this. Armor. Okay. Let, let, let Zealous have this, damn it. Alright, so... All right. He's good at. <laughs> so, Zealous, what armor are you getting, Ham Stone Shark? Um, Entertainer Charm, yes. Yes, you're getting her some entertainer charm? Yes. Just to get discounts on things I can buy for her. Okay. Uh, I mean, it's a fair exchange that she's going to give us some bab. Other than Let's go the... back to the... <laughs> Alright. Uh, so, other than you the fact she was willing to... Uh, just... If she's going into the dungeon with us, it is better that she not get murdered instantly. Yeah. yeah. We as players are better than that. That's... Even if we as characters are not. That's fucking amazing. I'm going to just turn us just jug the antidote. Okay, good. That's probably a good idea to jug antidotes. Probably Have him do a jug, slave jug. hand or coordination check. To there is no coordination <laughs> check in this game. This is not Star Wars. I have to sneakily drink the antidote without you guys seeing it now. So, uh, Tarnock, you're you gonna go. Took an antidote. You're gonna go buy armor for the Kobold at a discount. What armor are you getting her? Are you getting her light armor, medium armor, or heavy armor? Let's. Can I do a perception roll to see what kind of like, like kind of fighter she is? If that makes a sense. That'd be insight, wouldn't it? Yes, roll some insight. Insight, okay. I roll... Is it Winston? I actually have a good reason, okay. Okay. Do I, do I know what she is? Uh, she is very small and tiny. It seems as if a strong breeze could knock her over. Uh... Oh! I... Turn around. Oh, that's the wrong thing. Ignore that. Ah! Ignore what? Nothing. Boop. Okay. 
Uh, shit. Oh, okay. I turn around and I point at Dan's character and I grunt, basically grunting to ask if she does magic. <laughs> All right, okay, hold on. I'll, I'll be right back a second. I'm noticing some uh, noises. I gotta go. A little uh, wiggly hand. Uh, some noises. I gotta right. go check out. Be right back. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. She a maze or something? Oh. Derek is going to have so many questions when he finds you guys. Why do you have a small red lizard person following you like, around? Like, where did you pick up a cobalt? Can you repeat that? Oh, I'm just preparing for when we're ready. Okay. Well, uh... Well, at least Acker didn't have to roll four times on the poker chip again. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Unless you oh. forgot, in which case you probably shouldn't remind him. Well, I have returned, uh, what... I'll probably be able to hear whatever conversation you were having later in the recording. Uh... uh <laughs> where the hell were we? Um, cobalt and armor. I was pointing at Dan's character, asking the kobold if she did magic. Uh, I do a magic key trick while well, 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 he points at me, just just because I kind of have an idea of what he's doing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do the do the ang thing from Airbender, where it's like it's just like yeah. little balls swinging around. You just do that. <laughs> yes. Uh, you make the face. No, I, I can't do any magic. Uh, stuff's pretty difficult. Why do you have a kobold? <laughs> I, got, I got the, uh, got the other half of the map. See, look. <sighs> she holds it up. We're leaving in three days. I've secured our transport. Can we get to wherever this map leads in three days? It depends. Where does the map lead? Alright, so she says words. Hey, yeah, just a, it's just a couple, like a kilometer out or so? Maybe five? Six? A mile? Hmm. We could be. We could be able to make the trip tomorrow. Yeah, it doesn't sound too bad. Okay. I grab Phelan and just point at the kobold, push her towards her. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Uh, so, uh, before anything else, uh, Zealous, you said you wanted to buy her armor? Is Matt here? Oh, yes. I yeah, Matt, sorry, I was yawning. Okay, so okay. You, s you said you wanted to buy the kobold armor? Uh... Any armor for a reasonable price, yes. Okay, so the cheapest armor is padded armor. It's five gold points. Yeah, shit. Uh, do I get a discount with that, or is that already uh, a discounted price? <laughs> Four God. gold points? They took a gold point I'm off just because of how char charismatic you were. Four gold points off, okay. So that's one. No, no, no. Four total. Oh, yeah, sorry. Four total. Uh, they took a gold point off. Sorry. I, uh... So... Incorrectly did math it like it was... I'm sorry, can you repeat that? I'm trying to understand what's going on. Uh, okay, so... You said four total of what? Alright, so it started at five gold points for the cheap armor... And you've discounted it by one gold point. It's now four in total. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, shit. Yeah, I'll buy that for her. Okay. And just before I give it to her, I just look around for a charcoal and then I just sign my name on it. There you go, first autograph. <laughs> to her. To, to I give to her the armor with my <laughs> autograph on it. Okay, so you got some autographed 
padded armor. Yes. And she's just yes. happily jumping up and down about being given armor. It's like, yeah! <laughs> Excellent. Okay, now, uh... Oh, uh, what is Sim she equips it or something? Hmm? Not front of you, but yeah, she uh, jumps up and down and even hugs you before running off with the armor. So... Okay. And about, apparently, a day, you guys are going to be headed over to the dungeon. Uh, when you have dungeon background theme song you're going on here. Oh god, I wish I could use theme songs. So that's oh, that 28 uh, days until a wear rat. Um, plenty of royalty free music. <sighs> Alright, so it's just slightly down over there. Uh, I'm going to... Oh, fine. Yeah. Is there anything you wanted to do um, in this day, like for preparation for dungeon crawling? Oh, um, can we get some healing potions? Yes. Good point. <laughs> Actually, yes. I want to buy healing potions. That's the yeah. Smartest, that is the smartest fucking thing I've heard you guys say this whole fucking time. Oh my god. Considering it was 1v3. Ocean of healing, 50 gold apiece. I can get two. I only get four. I can only get two as well. Okay. <laughs> so, uh... We just dump all our money in the healing potions the moment we remember they this. I mean, we're gonna get more. Alright, so two health Doesn't potions matter. for Darius. Yeah. Our... I'm gonna... Okay, 2d4 plus 2 HP regain. Okay. Say that again. It's 2d4 plus 2 HP on the potions of healing. That's pretty good, considering you are level 3. So, uh, so... And considering Derek's my shitty two, health. Derek's buying 2, Tarnock's buying 4, Phelan's buying how much? 2. Okay, I'm, I'm just okay, loving this. They, how much do they cost? 50. 50 gold. They, fact, they cost 50 gold. I don't think I have enough of that. Accurate, you have a lot of money. Oh, yeah. Because I, <laughs> I forgot that how much money I had. Yeah, Why is a spyglass 1,000 gold yeah, gate? About... Because grinded oh. glass for, for glasses and such was really uh, uh, expensive. Hold on, hold on. Uh, sorry, uh, uh, what, how much? I'll just grab two. Okay, that's good. Just... What kind of zealous what kind of D D campaign are you running? Zealous, are you buying health potions? I'm going well, to. Uh... Oh, okay, here we go. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't really have any idea for preparations, but to get food, I guess okay. starvation. And you know, starvation all in dungeons is a bad idea. Okay. So. You don't know how long you'll be stuck in a dungeon for. Uh, so, rations are five silver pieces each. Uh. Uh. We have a ration that have five pieces of peach. So what are you saying? What? So, so it is five silver pieces um, for each ration. Uh, day of rations. Okay, then. In that case, uh, I'll, I, I guess I'll just go um, refresh the water supply. Okay. Um. Yeah, I, I really got nothing. It's just... Go ahead. All right, so I'm going to say that's a gold point, considering where you are and all the poison water. Water's pretty fucking uh, important. Okay, so is that all the preparation that's going to be taking place? Just a shit ton of health potions. That's all I wanted to do. I have one thing I want to do before we head out. Alright. On the magic item want ad. Ooh, yes. 
If anyone has a set of the Deck of Illusions, I will trade for a much more valuable set of cards. Yeah, that is what that want ad says. I'm going to take a look at that one, and then I'm really tempted to look into that, quote, stupid fucking wand that is apparently free. Will I have time before the end of the day to do these things? Yeah. Uh, one of these guys is actually inside of the uh, town itself. Okay. Does anybody want to come with me or do anything else with those? I'll pass. Okay. Which one's in town? Alright, so this one. Okay. This one right here? The wand okay. one. Alright, just shove me over there and I'll pick it up. Uh, fuck, there you are. Heck. Heck. Alright, so what you notice, um, this is a very familiar bugbear. <laughs> and he's just standing there in stunned silence, <laughs> looking at you. Hello? Hi, um... I heard you were trying to get rid of something. Yeah. Kick his face in. Um, no, 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 no. This is the guy from the mine. Oh, I fuck him. I'm, I'm, I'm just yelling for position. Wait. Kiss Shit. His face oh, in. my God. That <laughs> 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 just now. <laughs> oh, my God. Can I know what you did? What did I do? <laughs> <laughs> the mining operation that was lost from the wand was this the mishap that teleported us mine? Something happened. Uh, oh my god. I want this. I want this thing. I heard you were trying to get rid of something. You don't reckon? Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> uh, here we go. She, he, it just tosses you this, this, uh, this wand. Okay. Um, I'm going to examine this thing. It is made out of wood. Uh, <laughs> if you want to roll of an arcana check, you can. What is this thing? Okay. <laughs> Holy shit. That is the first check so far, well, second really, to recognize a thing. And I'm amazed. Uh, this is a wand of firebolt. Mm. Yep. Yeah, uh, now, what's the catch? Two charges until it has to like get a long rest in it, like a whole day. Oh, right. Other book. All right, I'll write that down, and I'm gonna go to see about the deck of cards. I'm just gonna leave now. Okay, bye. Just, the door slams behind you. <laughs> yeah, I don't imagine he's happy to see me. No, he's not. Who would be happy to see Derek? That's the guy we held up the orc flesh in front of and scared the shit out of. I know. Did I get that back? I'm still stunned you guys did that. We had food. I'm liking these drawings just being strewn about. Alright, so the next one's a little bit out of town. Uh, like, there's just little, very, um... These did I have time to go there? Uh, like, it's not that far out of town. It's, like, out of the way. Okay. Uh, so... You guess. said Wanda Fireballs, right? Firebolt. Firebolt. I'm not sure I'm... If Fireball is, like, fucking insane, why would I give you... Anyway. <laughs> It just obliterate all of my shit right away. Very well. Alright, uh, so you meet this dude. This, this, uh, this elf man. This Danny elf man. <laughs> uh, Baron Dan Daniels. Alright. Mm -hmm. And he's just leaning against this, uh, dingy little shack that he's in front of. Okay. 
Hello. So you're the Baron? I am the Baron. Baron Dan Daniels. Derek Ashara. Anyway. You were looking for something akin to one of these? I hold up the deck of cards. <gasps> oh! I wasn't expecting this so soon! My, my, this is, this is quite a collector's item. Indeed. Now, this is also a very useful little deck of cards. I'll you, say. you explicitly asked for it. You know what it does. I know what it does. Yes. What is it you're offering me in return? Uh, uh, this. He hands you a completely different set of cards. And holds it up. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mind if I take a look? By all means, but uh, I gotta check, make sure that deck of illusions is a real thing first. I'm gonna draw a card. Mm -hmm. And, oh, my deck is over there. One second! <laughs> Lovely. Okay, sorry about that. I didn't realize I had a deck I was using for illusions somewhere completely freaking else. Oh, okay, shuffling and drawing. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Alright, it's the frost giant. Again? Okay. I know, right? Jesus. Oh, wait, no, 13. This is... No, no, this is the priests and the acolytes. Okay. Ah! It's, kind of sh it's a working set, too! As I said, it's very useful. Now, what's so special about that one? Ah, this is, uh... <laughs> I just look at him expectantly. This is the, uh, the deck of... Hold on, fuck. <laughs> oh, God, what is this? Uh, th this is the deck of partial stability. Come again? Uh, the deck of partial stability. Partial stability. Okay, so he walks up to you, asking, and um, standing right next to you. Okay, take a card from there and throw it on the ground, just right over there. Just take a take a good toss. All right. He does so. Okay. Uh. Roll perception. Oh boy. Actually, I this should be passive perception. Uh, what is your passive perception? My passive perception is the twelve. <laughs> okay, so when you throw the uh, the card onto the ground, it does jack shit. But what you've noticed is he's immediately just <laughs> snatched your deck of illusions and is running off. Are you fucking me? <laughs> oh, this is hilarious. Wait, am I there? You, I, I don't know, did any of you come with me? I, I, I just follow you around, so I think I am. <laughs> you know, you have a giant lizard that can run really fast. Point. I'm okay with that if Gate is. Okay, so wait, what? <laughs> is any, did anybody else come with me is the thing. I always follow uh, you around, I so I think I did. Okay, so yeah. Uh, <laughs> Darnock and Derek... <laughs> that just fucking happened. Christ. All you gotta do his point. <laughs> I am going to point at him, and I'm just going to say, STOP! <laughs> I run after him. Ooh, wisdom. I do like w fucking charm checks against fucking elves. Damn it! Oh, but that's fucking garbage. 
Congratulations! <laughs> You've, even at fucking advantage, you, you, you got him. You just hear, ah, oh, shit! Oh, damn, I'm terribly sorry about that. I was just trying to steal your deck of cards. I shouldn't have been trying to do that. I rotate my hand, so my... You know, you know, I'm doing the pointy pointer finger motion. <laughs> I turn it upside down, and they just then start curling the finger upward. <laughs> Alright, so he, he, he walks over, back over. <laughs> Did you I hold my hand time? out. He puts the deck of cards in. I put that back in my pocket. I give him a... I look him right in the eye and just say, I'm not sure if Tarnock's eaten yet today. I'm going to give you a 30-second head start. Oh, I roll Intimidate. I'm going to need it. Oh, that should be with um, advantage, considering he's charming. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, uh... Imagine he... I'm so, how effective was that? I'm, uh, certainly gonna need it. And he just bolts. I look over to Tarnock. Have you actually eaten today? <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, I love that. I love that. Ah, lucky bastard. Aww. Let's get back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I had so much stuff prepared. I'm just glad this was one of the things that could be that was explored. So yeah, I am. So yeah, Derek and Tarnock return to wherever the rest of the party is, holding up a wand, and just say he's gonna hold up a wand. He's gonna put it down on well something. Do we have furniture of any sort, or is it just empty? Would you like to buy furniture? Did you buy furniture before leaving Jackstown? Because of course not. Then it's just a okay. Bed fine. And a treasure I'm, chest. I'm going to just put the wand on top of the treasure chest. Look at the party and just say, "Well, we got this. Got a stick. Oh boy." I thought you were going to go get something else. <sighs> Let's not worry about that one. Ooh, another thing. Another thing you can uh, do until whilst you're waiting for the dungeon. Dungeon. Uh, has anyone uh, anyone remember about the disadvantages twenty sided game dice? Ah hell! <laughs> she bought it. For the record, if anyone actually wants that wand, they can take it. If anyone wants to roll on this, they can, whilst you're in town. I don't think they will be very interested in magic. Uh, so no one failing. Acker could probably use it. Lord knows she'll have a better two hit check the rest of us. Wait, check what? Uh, There's a magic wand on the treasure chest. Do you want it? I will take that. Okay, so you got a wand of Firebolt. Uh, it contains two charges of the spell Firebolt. I'm imagining he's just going to put it there absentmindedly and not think about the fact that someone's going to grab it. Yeah, there's a there's a chest in everyone's room. like everywhere. So go for it. <laughs> just going to put it in the bag. Alright, so... There's that. So, uh, we can time skip again to the dungeon itself, if that's what everyone wants. Uh, yeah, I'm fine. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh, man. This... So, sorry for taking a little more time on that. No, no, by all means. Let's move over. So, you get to see the entire layout of the map when you finally get over. Like, there, w there wasn't very much obstacle getting here, but... I will allow you to put yourself in any of the entrances. Where are the entrances? Okay, so... It's like way over in the east. There's one right here. Uh, there's one right here. This one right There's here. like so many. 
Yeah. That long, that long hallway looks like you can actually hold. Actually what? The long hallways look like they can actually hold us. Alright, so which one? I'm okay I with the one we're on right now. I like the one. Yeah, I was, I was gonna suggest here too, so... Let's go with that. I'm going further I back. want... I like that at least to a nice big room. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'll go here too. And then the I would've little... liked the second to last one if there wasn't so many... Just paths leading off of that. Dibs on front runner. Okay, so... Oh, you know, I'll take the front. I'll, I'll take the front. You no. Know, apparently both no. hugging each other in the hallway. <laughs> um... <laughs> freaking... Move it, midget! Freaking... NPC... They're, they're, gonna, they're gonna try to race themselves to the door. Freaking just pushing it the Okay, so you're Bitch. aggressively getting toward the door. <laughs> Should we stop them? Um... It would depend, I suppose. Is the excitable lizard girl running after them? <laughs> That's my question. Yes. Ah, hell. Yay! <laughs> we should run after them. Indeed. <sighs> okay, uh, is the door locked? Okay, so, um, you can check. I had my- I knock the door fucking down with my butt. So headbutt this and foot a, knocked Would this be a combined check? Oh god, they're both Sure, both of you down. roll, uh, s strength with advantage. Alright. Is that the, yeah, safe throw? Ha! Mine did more damage. Even though it's not damage. You don't need to damage the door. Okay, so... Damage its spirit. You crack the door right off his hinges, and it just falls. We do that a lot, I notice. Yeah, fuck doors in general, Jesus. <laughs> okay, and I'm gonna pick up the door and use this shield now. This seems to be a common tactic. Like, no, like a big ship shield. It's a whole fucking door, but yeah, sure, uh, that'll give you yeah. one plus yeah, three yeah. whilst you're holding it. Yeah. Give it okay, to me. Do you see anything? Give it to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, now hold on. Let me just. Okay, so okay. you enter this fairly good long room. Uh, let's give control over to Met. And all you see in this room is a singular glass bottle in the middle of the room. Is it initiative time, by the way? How do you mean? Yeah, it's probably a good time to do that. You know what, just to, just to make sure everyone's get their own turn, by all means, roll initiative. Hell yeah! Uh, Gate, yes. I'm gonna roll initiative, but I'm, I need to go to the bathroom real quick. I'll be back in a second. Alright. It's fine. Uh, first. first. Oh, I didn't of course, Phelan gets higher initiative than the rest of us. You attempted to use a roll command looking for the value of a select tool, but no tokens are selected. Oh, wait, yeah. Uh, Alright, so... Turn off... Back. Hakra! Are you here? I am the he here. Alright. Uh, let me just... Select my pog first, so mm -hmm. that it doesn't go... I'm going to select your pog. Okay. Alright. Well, let's skip Phelan. Uh... Derek? Mm-hmm. What to do? Well, I'm gonna walk in past these two. Alright. Um, just very cautiously, though, because, you know, this is Zealous and Tarnock. They're not exactly going to be, you know, double-checking everything. Certainly not. Alright, so you're inside of this long, uh, slender room. Uh, you said that glass bottle's the only thing in it, right? Yeah, the glass bottle and couple cobwebs on the ceiling. I'm gonna examine that glass bottle. Right. Investigation, or... Yeah. Alright. It's a clear glass bottle. Just inexplicably in the middle of this room. Does it look clean? Uh... The inside of it, yes, all around it is covered in dust. 
That's a little suspicious. If it was just a, just a normal ass glass bottle, it would be filthy. I mean, it just sat right in the middle of the room. Well, the inside, in 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 the bottle, all around, it's dirty as shit. Yeah, that means something was in it recently. Oh, okay. So I'm not touching it. Okay, so you're gonna put it back down. I d I never touched it in the first place. Okay. I knelt down to look at it. All right. So, yeah, that's that. That's my turn. All right. So, uh, Zealous, what are you doing with that fucking? Uh, yeah. Uh, no, no, no. I can hear. I'm thinking. Um. Can I hold my action? Certainly. Go ahead. All right. Acra. Well, Dan. Oh. Hmm. Well, uh, let's see. Uh, I just realized encounters are going to be a pain in the ass now. Well, we don't have any max movement set on us, right? Just no max right? movement. Don't worry about that. Not until combat? Not until combat. Uh, it seems kind of fruitless to do that. I was say you're very quiet. Um, whoever watching on YouTube needs to, to raise the volume. Yeah, I'm sorry, but you know, it's all it's all we can do. It. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, outside of moving to follow everybody else, I um, I don't think I'm gonna do anything else because I'm too squishy otherwise. Oh, certainly the warlock, uh, Tarnock. What you doing? <clears throat> okay, I'm going to put my head up in the air and see if I can smell anything. Okay, that sounds like perception. Give us some of that. Wait, do you have a thing for that, by the way? Because I remember something about... I don't think... Well... Oh, lizard man in there. I, yeah, I don't think... I I just, it's just swimming and then just like being resistant to poisons and then like that sort of thing. I don't think it's uh like smell. Um. Well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I've, I've just been in the wild a lot, so I just rely on that. Okay. I smell. All right. What do I smell? Oh shit! You smell flesh. You smell a lot of flesh. Just this heaping. Of you said the F word. Flesh? <laughs> oh. Yes. Okay, it's just Where? a heaping fucking mound uh, of flesh coming from there and there. I grab Cetron's character soldier and keep, like, pulling it back and forth, and I point to the door. Which door? Yeah. All right, it looks like we're going that way. <laughs> All right, so the, uh, I'm gonna say that's Tarnak here. Turn, Phelan. Yes. Uh. Well, What's going on exactly? Is right. Tarnak hallucinating? Tar Tarnak is smelling something he's very attracted to. Through that door. Hmm. Speaking of attracted, I just realized because that poker chip encounters are gonna be really, really frustrating for Akra. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it doesn't seem like a bad idea, so Phelan's gonna follow Tarnock. Okay. It's more like we can't. It's it's more like Tarnock is gonna go that way regardless. So I'm just gonna follow. Okay. Um. Is anyone gonna open a door? I guess. Wait, you know what? Where's Zealous? Okay. He's behind.
behind the door. No, it's a shield. I'm using it's a shield oh now. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, that's right, you had your held action. Alright, Zell, so let's open the door. Yeah, okay, uh, just shit. Okay, I'm gonna open the door and just use your shield in front of me. Okay, so you're gonna put your hand on the door and open it, yes? Yes. Okay, that's lovely. Uh, take one piercing damage as a sudden needle comes through the knob. Alright, one damage. One oh. piercing damage and 2d10 poison damage. So, oh. Okay, even I have a shield. Okay. You no. Hold, 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 hold it, Citrin. Hold it. So, yep. you're opening the door with a shield? Yes. No, yay. That's that is yeah, not like, like 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 bash you and then just hold it down in front of the door. <laughs> <laughs> and that has nothing to do with the fact you just took piercing damage. Okay, so um. Okay, hold on. I I literally cannot picture what the fuck you're doing right now. <laughs> it's like putting a square block. The door down, I hold guess. on, let me let me just get a chip to show you this. <laughs> it's like putting a square block in a circle hole. He needs a gift to show me, and um. That that's that's interesting. Awesome. Um. I'll fucking say. Yeah. Hold on. Uh, God damn it. Um, what's that thing called? So, assuming you're either bashing uh, the door through or somehow... Yes. Okay, so... Let's go with athletics, because that's, that's a feat of strength right there. Okay, so I have to roll strength in? Athletics. Athletics. Oh, okay. Um, That's basically skills, strength. Skills, athletics. Damn. Okay, you're needlessly whapping your do a door against another door and desperately trying to open it. Everyone else seeing this is probably free to laugh at the idiot. Anyway. Packers just like... Phelan is just wondering what the heck he's losing, doing. He's just losing brain mass at an alarming rate. <sighs> Alright, let's go back to the turn order. Shit. Uh, Derek? Uh, yep. That's the thing. So, all Zealous did was try to bash the door open. He didn't touch the knob? Apparently not. Uh, okay. Derek is going to just kind of gently move Zealous aside and just... Try to turn the knob. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, we don't make the game nearful. Yeah, see. That was my yeah. thought. It's like It's like because if that's if that's the case, then he would have had no idea the trap was <gasps> Yeah. Yeah, we don't make a game here, Velos. <laughs> <laughs> so Alright, so one piercing damage. Uh roll constitution. Uh, okay. Ouch. Frick! Alright, so... 2d10. Uh, 14 poison damage, and you are poisoned for an hour. Okay! <laughs> oh, God. What happened? Oh, it was more like a nauseous thing. That there was, was a poison needle in the fucking doorknob. Well, the door's open, at least. But, you know... Ow. Derek, are you alright? Alright. Now, speaking of meat, uh, meat flesh smell, you all smell it now once the door's open. And I don't feel good. Whatever the hell this is just appears. Well, not just appears, but is on the other side of the door. Oh my goodness. How many faces yeah. does it oh. What the hell is that gate? Yeah. That is horrific. You had a lot of fun making that, didn't you? Oh my god, I've had this forever. I even had to be like, oh, oh. shit, no, this is too fucking uh, high challenge rating, and I had to wait until later to give it up. You were waiting to use this. I was. I the thing was. is, I think I know what it is, but 
the party doesn't know what it is, so I'm gonna keep my mouth shut. Yes, good. Alright, uh... Let's see. Each creature that starts a turn. Alright, so... That's, that's, that, that thing is in the hallway, whatever that is. Yeah. It is flesh. It will be consumed. Uh, as soon as the gnome moves. You can move through allied spares, but I don't, I don't get... Fine, I'll stomp on the gnome. Three, okay. Oh, Jesus, okay. By the way, since I actually moved through the door, I'll probably, I'm probably... Yes, you are. Uh, Fuck is thing. Yeah, that's that's uh, that is the question, isn't it? Christ. Okay. Um. I am just probably gonna try to give front up. Uh, Derek, can I get in front of Derek? Yeah. Uh, roll. You can move through allied squares. Yeah, you can move okay. through allied squares like nothing. All right. So okay, you... and and I'm gonna hunker down with a shield. Slam that shield down, yeah. Yeah. Just right, so, uh, yeah. uh, Tarn, well, Derek and, um, Zealous, I'm going to need you to roll a wisdom saving throw. Both of you. Motherfucker. Oh, no. Motherfucker. Uh, Zealous, your turn? Yeah, that's my, yeah, that's my turn, yeah, yes. <laughs> I know, but roll a wisdom saving throw. I think it's because we looked at the thing. Yes, this... <laughs> oh shit, I know what this is! Yeah. I mean, yeah, I have no idea. Hey, I hope you like sharing an HP pool for a while! Oh. Zealous? Yeah. Or wisdom? Oh, uh, okay then. Um. What's the, what's the, what's the... Oh. Well... A failure, the creatures can't take reactions until the start of its next turn, and rolls a d8 to determine what it ju does during its turn. So, yeah! we'll get to that when the. Thank hey, fuck for this shield right here. Let's hope it also. <laughs> Acra. Okay, I'm gonna just go, uh. I'm just gonna go check out what the fuck is going on up there. Oh boy. Uh. Movement applies now, I guess. A little bit. Lucky. Go... You can go through squares, it's fine. Alley squares are nothing, nothing go through. What the hell? Uh, yeah, speaking of what the hell, roll wisdom. <laughs> not, not because of the poker chip, something else. I mean. Actually, fuck it. Roll it twice. Oh. <laughs> no! <laughs> Ooh. Oh my god. Ooh. No! Roll it twice. <laughs> uh, a second time for the poker chip of love. Anyway, uh, good job. Okay, good. Uh, yeah, this is a little better. Uh, is it bad that I'm glad that that the, that the crit fail what that the crit that the crit fail was for the actual harmful effect and not the poker chip? <laughs> All right, we so... can always flip it around. <laughs> I mean, what would be more harmful than the right? It would be the poker chip. So roll a d8 to determine right. what's oh. going to happen. Alright, I'm back. Sorry. Nobody has succeeded on the roll so far. It's amazing. Oh, shit. Uh, you can't really... The minute you look at this, you're just standing in horror horror at what what this conglomeration of just flesh, teeth, faces, and eyeballs. My trigger word! <laughs> yes. Uh, I just gotta say, considering, <laughs> considering what my uh, patron is, it should probably be like a regular Tuesday. <laughs> just... <laughs> well... <laughs> This is still disgusting as shit. Tarnock! I run over here, and then I freaking run straight through everyone, and jump off Met's thing into the flesh pile. What do we need to roll? Okay, you know what? Roll wisdom with advantage. 
Because you're you're more bestial than the rest of the party. He literally is, and he this is like his favorite thing. This is a big pile of meat. Okay, the only one to succeed that saving throw. Uh, oh, he would have. He would have succeeded. It makes sense. Finishes. It makes and sense. He goes in for the consume. All right. So what to do with this disgusting pile of? What do you think gross he's flesh. Do? What? What? Ooh. How how far can I go jumping off of Mets thing? Can I go over to the other side? When do you need to do acrobatics? Yeah. Yeah, I think I did. Acrobatics go on the other side of it. Yeah. I get on the other side. Get on the other side. All right. Uh, is that what you're doing? I love I'm going Tardex. to attack it. Okay. I love how Tardex is trying to copy uh, Sila's thing. It's great. <laughs> now I want to just like go back in time and not. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh, no, I'm gonna, yeah, weapons, and get my two, or should I, I'm just gonna normal bite this guy, so two normal bites. Okay. It goes mad how delicious this creature is. Would you Fuck, believe, those are bad. Would you believe both of those still hit? Really? Damn, this guy's got low AC. Yeah. Okay, 10 damage. Damage. Oh, I'm gonna have fun. Consuming <laughs> this creature as Famous you go. Famous last words. Anyway. You do realize I am anti whatever this thing is. Okay, so you've taken a whole chunk of meat out of this uh, creature and just eaten it. Trigger word. <laughs> and anything of a similar nature is his, are, are his trigger words. Alright, so now it's its turn, and... Ooh. It's going to make a... It's going to bite you in response. <laughs> this thing bites that. Oh, okay. Uh, what's your AC? 15. Alright, so you narrowly dodge out of the way of that, and... <laughs> Holy shit. With its multi attack, it's actually going to spit something at you, too. <laughs> All right. I missed again, didn't it? Uh, yeah, I did. <laughs> Lucky you. Lucky I you. I am going to eat all of it. Oh, boy. Uh, Phelan. Yes. You, uh, you can notice from where you're standing, uh, Acra and part of Derek just standing there in shock. At whatever they're seeing in the hallway. Uh, okay. Um, What's our little cobalt friend doing? Yes. <laughs> oh, right. Speaking of which. Phelan's going to try and march ahead of them because truly there is something over here. Oh, guess what? Yes. With some saving throw. Yes. Just, just peek around that? the door. Ah! This saving throw is crap. What? What? How is that crap? You must be too stupid to understand what's happening in front of him. What this horrible thing is. It's like, oh, if it's just this uh, face meat pile. Nothing strange here. Uh, well. Well, indeed. What you doing? What a strange moving meat pile. You know what we do with strange moving meat piles? Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it! Sal, before you roll, remember, you get advantage since I'm on the other side. Yeah, you're flanking a pile of meat right now. <coughs> flanking a pile of oh. meat. Oh! Good! Flanking the pile of meat and faces. That's a, uh, thing being said. Alright, so you cut a good chunk uh, of this. Flanking SCP-610? <laughs> All right. You're not wrong. Taking a good <laughs> chunk of meat out of this meat, uh, Derek. Uh, yeah. Roll wisdom. Oh uh, boy. It's like the start of every turn, kind of thing. Oh boy, roll a d8. 
You didn't. Know. You just. You're still standing in shock. Like this is the most disgusting thing you've ever seen. Kill it! Kill it! Kill it! Kill it! Zealous. What does the poison do, by the way? Um, it gives you disadvantage on. Oh shit! Well, you've already failed that check. Yeah. Uh, it, it gives. Uh, because I'm going with the uh, the poison thing on the. Okay. The thing. A poison creature has a disadvantage on attack rolls and ability checks, so. Just disadvantage on everything, gotcha. Yeah, basically. Uh, Zealous, are you here? Yep. Alright, uh, roll wisdom. Uh, see if you can knock yourself out of this daze. Christ. Okay, good. You can actually do something this turn. Alright. So I am gonna. S I can't. <laughs> I can't stand beside her, right? Um. It's it's He's gonna be small. very difficult to do this with a do holding a door. Uh, I'd say in acrobatics to effectively um, share spaces, or you're gonna be taking disadvantage on checks. Disadvantage. Okay. Uh. That's not what I meant. Honestly, I'm surprised the, he's not launching The so acrobatics much. check is the normal one. So, roll oh. that again. Okay. Alright, you can share a space and attack, but only for a turn, and you're going to have to return to your square back once you turn. Okay, um... Yeah. Just, I'm going to move over here. We'll just consider you holding that door so you know... You're not yeah, the whole yeah, time. of course. Yeah, of course. Uh, okay, um... I'm going to start ram the shield door they on this monster. Okay, that's so basically a... unarmed. Uh, that's an improvised weapon, actually. So it is oh. unarmed. You are literally armed with a door. <laughs> so Okay, well, what do I roll for that? Uh, that's a 1d4, so... Yeah, basically unarmed, but it isn't unarmed. Okay. Do I? No, I cannot do it twice. All right. Um, wow. Oh wow. Okay. Max damage. Good stuff. Actually, hold on a second. Uh, I need to split the recording. <laughs>